fire on the asphalt L.A. freeway Santa Ana windstorm Come blow me away This rear view mirror You some adjustment Some other reflection Some other place Cumberland, I'm your faithful son. No matter where I run, he called me. My music, I hope, well, it, it is an expression of the love I felt and, and the familial culture that I knew. Hopefully, it it's a you know. Especially those early records and the things are minor's prayers about about his death and uh, or it references his life and it was after his passing that I came back and wrote it. I wrote it out here and um, bury me. I wrote it out here. It's uh, you know it's, it, I think had I not moved so far away, things wouldn't have crystallized so so acutely for me as a writer, perhaps. I was certainly able from this vantage point to write in a, in a more specific way because I only had my thoughts to recall everything by. We didn't even have uh, note shape singing. There was not even any musical staffs allowed. In the mountains, now you would go to other primitive Baptist churches in Lexington or Knoxville, of course, they would sing out of hymnals. We sang out of a little leather-bound hymnal called the Goble Hymnal. Old, uh, old lyrics, um, you know, from from Shakespearean times. Uh, a lot of minor melodies. Uh, the harmony was kind of stacked the way a dulcimer is tuned. Um, uh, very similar, if not identical, to Ralph Stanley's uh, upbringing uh, in, in, in music. Because uh, when, you know, I would go to church when I became familiar with Ralph Stanley, well, that was very uh, familiar to me, because that's, that's the kind of singing I'd always heard. You know? Some really beautiful voices. But I always felt you, Louisville gave us a unique perspective that I feel like Louisville is this like island. I feel like that people, a lot of people try to cast names onto it and labels. Like a lot of people, you know, when you're up in New York and people hear you from Louisville, Kentucky, they're like, oh, you're a southerner, you're from the south. And we're like, well, not really. Yeah. You know, when you're down in the south, you're like, yo, yanks. You know, yeah. like, you're all, and we're like, well, not really. And I feel like our band has always identified with that because we have never been anything really like we're not quite hippie enough for the hippies we're not quite cool enough for the coolies and so we just like exist in some place where people who hopefully don't label themselves can enjoy what we do lexington too i feel like there's these kind of places that are i feel like people have to fight harder for their own identities because people want to la label you as something and we've kind of always prided ourselves on never wanting to be labeled and just always want to play as many different kinds of music as we can but i think that's the biggest thing with Louisville is that it, you know, it, it has to fight for what it is. Ooh.